Now, I guess Pooh Shiesty was telling the truth when he said he doesn't need no security in the club, but due to him not having it, he can now be facing 20 years in prison for his actions. Now this is something we need to talk about, let's get straight into it. Now May 30th at the King of Diamonds Club in Miami, Memphis rapper Pooh Shiesty was performing for a crowd on one of the craziest weekends in Miami. During his performance, Pooh Shiesty, he was seen having $40,000 cash in his skinny jean pockets. It was literally so much cash in his pockets, especially the left back pocket for some reason. It's like he stuffed $30,000 in that one pocket. Now while performing some of the cash, it ended up falling out of his pockets. Allegedly, a fan that was sitting on the floor ended up smacking a stack of money from his left pocket, making all of the money just go everywhere on the floor. All of the people in the crowd started swarming the stack of money that fell onto the ground. It was hanging out of his pocket and so much, honestly, he should have been expecting this. Now when the cash started falling out of his jeans, the music stopped. Pooh Shiesty, he stopped performing, told them to cut the beat. Pooh Shiesty started looking for somebody in the crowd who robbed a majority of this cash. Now after this, this was until Pooh Shiesty, he then stormed off of the stage, started heading out of the club where he was seen on video putting a firearm in or out of his jeans waistband. A lot of people were saying he was taking it out. After he ended up getting out of the camera's view, that's when a firearm ended up going off. The entire club started going crazy on the inside. People were running around left, right, and center, ducking over tables and flipping tables over for cover. Nobody knew what was going on until a few hours went by when everything started to silent in the room and everyone was able to get a getaway out of the club. Then a few hours later, Pooh Shiesty, he then went on social media to put on his story saying false allegations, nothing never been taken from me. Now he was trending on social media by internet trolls saying that he was robbed, $40,000 cash, the crowd hit a lick on him, people saying that he actually does need security as he got robbed 40 k all kinds of stuff, it was starting to get a little bit ridiculous. Now typically, when a rapper's chain gets snatched or they get robbed for cash on video, there will be a video that goes around online about it, whoever did it, you know, flexing for internet clout and things in that nature. But in this case, nobody did any video like that, so it is safe to say that Shiesty, he's telling the truth that nobody took anything from him. Now it wouldn't be until June 8th where the actual details of this entire situation would be released to the public. Now charges were then filed against Pooh Shiesty on June 4th, but it wasn't until June 8th where we saw Shiesty turn himself into jail. Shiesty was then booked into jail where he is currently being held until his bail hearing. Shiesty was then hit with a numerous amount of charges of robbery, theft, firearm charges, and allegedly a few more to be added soon. So according to the arrest warrant, Pooh Shiesty, he was performing at the club when somebody knocked the stack of cash out of his back pocket. Now as we mentioned before, the crowd got very excited that a bunch of cash plopped onto the floor. That's when Shiesty actually got angry, hopped onto the floor with the crowd, and was trying to grab his money. But it was too late. Pooh Shiesty, as I said, then hopped back on stage for an overview of the crowd to see who stole the cash. Pooh Shiesty, being angry in the situation, was then seen maybe grabbing at his waistband while on stage. That's where his firearm was located, and that's when a security guard of the club ended up putting his hands on Pooh Shiesty's hand and then was seen nodding his head at Shiesty. That's when he actually then walked off the stage and was seen taking it out of his waistband when no one was there to stop him. And then that's when a witness claimed that 
Pooh Shiesty used the firearm and then after using it, actually handed the firearm over to somebody who had a face mask on. He then dashed the scene. He has never been found again after that incident. Now the rap world's favorite lawyer, he then spoke about the situation, giving some very important details. Now the rap lawyer claims that due to how severe this case is, with it being caught on camera, witnesses seeing Pooh Shiesty using the firearm, Pooh Shiesty is looking at 20 years in prison. And an easy way of understanding this is the Florida has a 1020 life law. Now basically, you will be put in prison for 10 years if you pull out a firearm. You'll be put in prison for 20 years if you pull out that firearm and you use that firearm. And then you will be sentenced to 25 to life in prison if somebody is affected by the firearm that you used. Now that is just a simple way of explaining the 1020 life law that Florida has. Now Pooh Shiesty, he was seen on video pulling out this firearm. So it's not really that big of a case at this point. Not to mention there was also a witness who says they saw Pooh Shiesty even use the firearm. So the law enforcement, they have everything they need to basically put Pooh Shiesty behind bars for a very long time. And this isn't even to mention that Pooh Shiesty, he was actually involved in a whole other case last year where allegedly Shiesty used a firearm, people got affected by the situation, and again, there's witnesses to claim that he was actually there. So Pooh Shiesty right now, He's looking like he's in a very terrible situation. Pooh Shiesty is one of the fastest growing rappers in the world right now due to his hit song with Lil Durk. Now in that song, Pooh Shiesty uses the lyrics, I got my own fire, I don't need no security in the club. So to live up to his lyrics as all street rappers need to do, he literally had no security in there. Most rappers, they do have security. That's the smartest thing for a rapper to do in situations like this. Now, Pooh Shiesty, he got himself in an incident now where he needed to defend his own rather than a security guard do it for him who could have took the heat and is actually a licensed security guard where they're allowed to carry firearms. Now this whole situation, it could have been avoided in a major way if Pooh Shiesty just had security with him, as he already should, not to mention if he didn't have $40,000 cash sitting in his skinny jeans pockets. Lawyers have already came out to claim that he should be looking at around 20 years in prison. I'm really hoping that doesn't happen. Pooh Shiesty is definitely one of the fastest growing rappers right now. He's got a great career ahead of him. He just needs to stay out of jail. And it kind of seems like a lot of rappers right now are having the same situation. NBA Youngboy is another guy who needs to stay out of lockup as he is again, another huge rapper. But anyways guys, I'm ending the video here. I hope you enjoyed and I'm out. Peace.